Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel, Island Girl in the Meadow World. If you're new, welcome. Join the club. If you are returning, thank you so much for your support. I really, I really appreciate it. I love you all so much, you don't even know. So, my name is Neola, and I am a second year medical student at the University of the West Indies Capital Campus. And I decided to do this video about general tips and stuff I learned in my first year of medical school. So, let's begin! So the first tip I'm going to say is run your own rat race. Do not compare yourself to other people. Work at your own pace. Know yourself. That honestly is so important. Know yourself, know what you're capable of. And do not compare yourself to other people run your own rat race because everyone's medical school journey is going to be different another thing is you're going to need a good support system so find you some friends to hold you down because they know the struggle they know what it's like because there's sometimes you're gonna be like Ooh, what did I sign up for the wor workload is gonna be crazy deadlines are going to be approaching for assignments and labs you just gonna be tired and all you want to do is sleep and you know you're going to need your support system so Get you some good friends, get you some support from your family, you're going to need that cheerleader because it's going to be hard. Secondly, thirdly, thirdly, find you some good study habits that will work for you. If you must read, read. If you must interact with other people, interact and discuss with others. If you need a YouTube video, use the YouTube video, you know. Find study habits that work for you. Um, another tip, you can push yourself, but please remember at the end of the day, you are only human. Please remember that. Don't take off more than you can chew. Work to your own pace. But remember, there's a balance. Life is about balance. The balance is key. So, you know, make time for social life. Make time to take care of yourself, you know? Remember, you're only human. Um, pre-read. Pre-read, pre-read, pre-read. Even if you don't have time to pre-read before the lecture, watch a YouTube video. It can be really, really helpful. So when you're in class, you're not, oh my gosh, I am so lost. I don't know what's going on. Pre-read. However, if that's impossible, which was sometimes impossible for me to do, go over what you learn immediately afterwards. So in the day, if you did, if you had four lectures that day, when you go home, go over those four lectures. And if you don't understand something, don't be scared to, you know, talk to the lecturer and be like, sir or ma'am, I do not understand what was taught. Don't be afraid to book an appointment. Also, when you get back grades from midterms or whatever and you're not satisfied with them or you want to know where, went, where you went wrong, book an appointment. Book an appointment to sit down with your lecturer, let them go through the exam paper with you. So you know, okay, these are topics that I need to brush upon. These are topics that I need to go over. I found that was really helpful for me. And I could also see the difference in when I didn't do it for certain courses. And it was really helpful in preparing for finals. Another thing, interact with students above you. You are all on this medical school journey together. And they know what it's like. They already passed that stage. So interact with students above you. Um, another thing, use as many resources as possible. Please do textbooks, past papers, well not past papers, but questions, YouTube videos, you know, just use as many resources as possible. Another thing that I found was really important, that was kind of hard for me to quote put, is do not be afraid to fail. You're not a failure, you never will be. If you fall down, get back up brush off your knees and go again do not ever be afraid to fail okay no medical school <laughs> the journey to medical school is not going to be easy you're going to need passion dedication you're going to need determination perseverance and most and foremost you're going to need to love what you're doing remember at the end of the day why you signed up for medical school why did you join this journey why did you begin you know that is going to be so, 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 I cannot stress how important it is. If you love what you're doing, it's not going to feel like a chore. We have to go over how much ever lectures you need to go over. 
it's not gonna feel like a chore because you love what you're doing you love what you're learning I remember balance is key please make time for you you're always going to have tons and tons and tons of work to do please 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 make time for you even if it's you need to watch that one movie or you need to do your hair or spend some time with your girls or go out to dinner or something make time for you but remember at the end of the day life is about balance um i think that's it i don't think there's anything else peace please don't forget to like share and subscribe comment what y'all think about this video and i'll join you again next time bye